Global Footprint Network has actually an anniversary to celebrate. Uh, in a few days, we'll be moving, marking the first completed first year of our partnership with Schneider Electric, a global specialist in energy management and automation with operations in more than 100 countries. Schneider Electric is one of the few companies whose business strategy is aligned with moving humanity out of ecological overshoot. From Schneider, we are joined today by Esther Finidori, Manager of CO2 Strategy. Esther, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. It is such a pleasure to have you on and it's such a pleasure to have Schneider as our, our sponsor and our, our partner. So I know that the work that you do at, uh, at Schneider is on CO2 strategy, but could you tell me a little bit more about what Earth Overshoot Day means to you in your role and for, and for the company? Well, for Schneider Electric, uh, Earth Overshoot Day is an important milestone during the year because it's a date when we can take a step back and assess our targets uh, against the ecological overshoot equation. So it's a date at which we can challenge ourselves and think, is my business model really one planet compatible? Um, to succeed, we believe we need to focus both on efficient new infrastructure and on retrofitting existing assets. For example, in OECD countries, 50% of buildings that will be in use in 2050 are already built. So half of the work is to design and build new efficient, flexible assets that are one planet compatible by design. But we shouldn't forget the second half, which is to retrofit existing infrastructure. That's fantastic. I think it's often that we talk about the actions that need to be taken and it's about these new technologies and things that are very much in the future. And it's amazing the work that Schneider is doing that's retrofit, it's existing technology, it's things that we already have access to. So with that in mind, you have a, I know there are plenty of initiatives that, that Schneider is working on, but what's one that really is inspiring to you in terms of moving the date? Well, what we, what we see and that excites us the most is that we see an increasing share of businesses uh, that think long term and uh, that understand that they're operating in the world of finite resources. Uh, for instance, a recent poll showed that 82% of our customers in Europe consider resource scarcity and sustainability in their decision making. And, and for us, of course, um, this is core uh, to, um, to the challenge. Um, more specifically, we see a huge business potential for a more circular economy. Uh, we can reuse, uh, repair, uh, retrofit existing assets to prolong their lifetime. Digitization here is a game changer in how we manage those assets. It enables remote control, optimization of operations, preventive maintenance, etc. So all in all, we do see circular economy as a driver for business innovation that is good for the planet and good for the business which is key as we move forward. We definitely would like to make sure that that happens in a sustainable, not just for the planet, but for the organizations and economies that thrive on, on the natural resources that we use. So my last question for you is, and I feel like this one's all about passion. <laughs> if there is one thing that you would like to see in the next year, what would be the one challenge or issue you would like to see movement on? Well, at Schneider Electric, we estimate that if today 100% of existing buildings, industry, data centers were equipped with active energy efficiency technologies, uh, and if the electricity grid was upgraded with renewable, we could collectively move the date back by 21 days. Technologies to move the date are available. Um, the economics are there as well, if you consider both short-term value with immediate savings from resource efficiency and the long-term value of future-proof assets. So one year from now, what I want to see, what we want to see is companies fully account for the value of those assets that are one planet compatible uh, and embrace uh, and unlock the potential for uh, retrofits. I'm so excited that we are working together to move the date. <laughs>